Hey, hello there and a warm welcome to this special day. Because it's time to celebrate Tabaski here in the Gambia. Let's eat, pray and be cool. Let's explore. Let's explore. We start our day on the road because we are invited to celebrate this feast of sacrifice with a local family. The village of Katong will have six more inhabitants for one day. And when we arrive, preparations are in full swing. Well, we brought in some extra chairs to sit on, but the time to relax will come later, because we're up for an important part of this day, morning prayer. The whole village comes together at the mosque, all wearing their best costumes and bringing their own rock to pray on. Men and women split up, and when everyone is ready, the praying begins. Well, the whole Tabaski feast is in honor of Ibrahim, who was willing to sacrifice his son to God. In the end, his son doesn't die though, because an angel tells Ibrahim to slaughter an animal instead. Which brings us to the next part of this day. Yep, you know what is about to happen. When you slaughter a goat or sheep, it's tradition to give a third to relatives and neighbors. Another third is for those in need and the last part is for you and the family, to be enjoyed all together. Starting off with the heart and we get an extra special piece of meat right after that. It's like penis. Yes, of the goat. Okay. I eat it? <laughs> no, the scent in there, really. Gone. Yes. Gone. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that was a weird food experience for sure. The rest of this day, the celebration continues, with kids collecting pocket money from relatives and neighbors to buy some small ice cream or goodies, for example. And, of course, the cooking and eating goes on. But we have to say... Wow, this country really surprised me. It's very small, but there are a lot of opportunities to go off the beaten path. If you have any tips and tricks for this area, please leave them in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe. See you next time. Doodle.